morning parents. Welcome to room A. My name is Gracie Vargas and I will be the teacher. To start off with, I'm going to show you where the cribs are at and who belongs in the crib. Now if your child is under, if he's not walking, he belongs in the crib, okay? And the cribs are labeled with their name right here so there's no mistake we will not put a child in somebody else's crib. This right here is my education board. This is the lesson plan and here's a schedule that tells me when it's time to transition to a different activity. Right here is the weather. When it's too cold or too hot, I come and I look at this and, I, and it tells me if I should go outside or I should not go outside. Right here is your child's portfolios. Now, this is why I've been asking my parents, send me pictures so I can put them in here. This right here is a lending library. You're more than welcome to check out a book and bring it back whenever you're done. In here, we have our chemicals. Now, this is always locked for the protection of the kids and us. So this key right here is in here and it's always locked. Right here, we have another crib. This is our humidifier. It's not plugged in right now, but it, it will be all day while the kids are in here. This little center right here is a safe place. If your child's not feeling uh, well, is crying, is not having a, a great day, you know, they're more than welcome to come sit here for a little bit, and then whenever they feel better, they can get up. Here we have Max and Lily. They will be with me at the circle, and we will let the children hug, you know, hug if they want to play with Max or Lily. This center right here is the music center. And right here we have different instruments, drums, and everything different that your child can play with. If he wants to sing or dance, they can do it in this area. This center over here is my morning circle. Here is where I will be asking the child, how do they feel today? Are they happy? Are they sad? Are they frustrated? Here we will sing nursery rhymes, finger play, uh, all kinds of different kind of music. We will also be dancing here. The, here's another center that the child, if they're not interested in, in hearing me sing or something like that, they can always get something from here to play with. This next center right here is my, land, like my library. Now in the library we have all new books, so the child can come and get a book and sit in this area right here and look at the pictures, right? And then when they're done, they can put it again. In this basket, we have some puppets. If the child wants to play with some puppets while they are looking at a book, that's also fine. This is my rocking chair. If a child is feeling uh, sad or something and they want me to hold them, I will sit here and I will hold them until they feel better. And if you come to this area right here, there's the pretend and learn center. In here, we have food, we have dolls, we have cell phones, we have a writing pad. This is the pretend center so the children can pretend like they're washing dishes or they're cooking something on the stove. Next, we have, this is the door that will take us outside. And I'm going to open the door. Now keep in mind that the grass is not cut, but it will be, okay? So this is where we'll be going outside. And it is very big, as you can see. It's all fenced in. So you sure that will be safe. There's no way they can get out. They added some new equipment to the playground, which will be more interesting. Right there on the side, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a storage. In there, we have a lot more material that we can get out, like bicycles, little horses, little lawnmowers that they can also use. And over here, we have a sink. A sink where we We'll be washing our hands. I will wash my hands. You shall wash your hands frequently. Okay. In here we have materials. All new materials: construction paper, play-doh, colors, paint, paint brushes. That we will be doing activities on the table. And I forgot to show you my art wall. This is my art wall. Once your child is done with whatever we're doing, collaging, painting, scribbling, coloring, I will put it here. And once it's up here for like a couple of days, I will take it out and I'll put it in the portfolio and then we will work on something else. This right here is my fine motor center and the science center and the construction center. This, they can play here and sit on the carpet, get whatever they want to. Either they sit here or they can sit on the table. This right here is like a little butterfly. They just can climb up here and then 
slide down or come over you with a stair jump. This will help her develop some motor skills. These are my tables, so we will sit down and eat. The teacher chairs are right here. The child's chair is right here. As you can see, they're small. They're not high, so they won't, they're safe. This is my changing table. Well, I will change the diaper. As you can see, we're full of diapers, wipes, gloves. This is my three steps that I do after I change every child's diaper. With water, soap, and bleach, and then uh, soap and water. And this is why I change the diaper. If the child is walking, I will take this out, the step. Let me see if I can do this. Right here, and then I can lock it right here so it doesn't move. And then I can hold your child's hand as they walk up here, and they lay right here. And then once they walk down, I will pull it up like this. And of course, lock it. In here, we have our bathroom. Our bathroom is in here. The child will be coming in here to wash their hands. The sink is right here. There is a little stepper right here where the child will be standing if they cannot reach. This little stepper right here. Wash their hands, the soap. If they need help, I will be helping them. The paper towels are right here. This is my phone. If you want to call to see how the child's doing, you're more than welcome. If you have that number, if not, you can let me know. And then, lastly, we have our refrigerator where we keep the mail. This is a log where we keep the uh, temperature. So every morning, I will check the temperature of the freezer and of the water, I mean the bottom one, and make sure that it's working properly so we can keep our food safe, okay? This center right here, the little baby center right here, is like creates creativity station. Here we have new ink pads, we have colors, we have markers, we have shots, we have Play-Doh, everything that the child will need to be creative in their own way. Here are our cots. These are our cots where if your child's walking already, I will get the cot, get a blanket, and then put it somewhere where I can see them, okay? This thing right here is new. If your child's not feeling well, and I have called you, and you are on your way to pick them up, then this will be around them, just to keep them safe and keep the other children safe. And that is